My mum and my dad and my brother were massive for me. Um, my mum and dad both worked full time. My dad worked on the buses. My mum was working in the NHS. And I, was, I think when I was 11, I was travelling to and from Bolton back to Manchester four or five times a week. When I was 15, I had you know, numerous offers from you know, the majority of the Northern teams. Um, and I was actually going to join Man City. I'd made my mind up. Um, you know, I wanted to stay closer to home. I was 15 years old. I had my friends around me. Um, and actually heard my mum and dad having a conversation downstairs. Um, and my dad said he'd be slightly disappointed in me if I chose the, the easy option and stayed in Manchester. Um, so I went back to my room that night, thought about it and walked, walked down in the morning and told him that I'd decided to join Arsenal. It definitely made me grow up a lot quicker. Um, like I said, I was 15 years old and I went down to London. I didn't really know anybody. Um, I was fortunate enough to be in digs with a wonderful family who looked after me. But like I said, it made me grow up. It made me, you know, definitely a lot more dedicated to football, and it allowed me to remain focused on, you know, training and performing at a high level. It's my dad. He's constantly on my case that I don't score enough goals, and constantly sending me videos or slight digs, you know. With, how have you missed this one, son, or why are you not there? So he's kept me on my toes in that regard, and um, it is something that I need to make sure I keep adding to my game, you know, with the size and physique that I have and the um, quality that we have and the deliveries now from set pieces. You know, I should be getting five, six, seven goals a season. It's something that I enjoy. It's something that, you know, I think I need. You know, I need people pushing me and, you know, I use it as motivation to go out there on the pitch and you know, try and do my best for the team. It's about you know, being proud of the performances that I give out on the pitch and um, the leadership role that I, have, that I have within the group, knowing that not only have I done everything I can myself on the pitch, but I've also tried to help the teammates around me, and that's you know, really important for me. It's the best league in the world, you know, it's a real proud moment to be walking out on that pitch. You just you have to cherish these moments because you know they don't last forever. 